What's up guys, Jonathan here with TLD. Today is the official launch date of the App Store for the Mac. Just as a quick note for you guys, there is no download link on Apple's page. You must do this with a software update. If you don't want to do that, you go up to the top corner with your little Apple logo, click software update, let your Mac do its thing. When you come back, you will have the App Store. Again, it's in the bottom corner. That's what it looks like, and this is the actual whole layout of the App Store interface. So they have tons of apps and games already. I downloaded Twitter. Uh, so let's go ahead and open that up for you. Previously, I was using Tweety for the Mac, so this is kind of cool. Uh, layout looks good. It looks really light. There's your at replies, your tweets through the timeline. There's MTP flyers. He's at CES. I will be down there later. Soldier knows best. Dude from Ukraine. Shout outs to those guys. Waffle John. So nothing too crazy here, just so you guys can see. This is a free application downloaded from the App Store. It's kind of nice having everything all in one. We'll go ahead and close that for now. We got the little bird up in the top corner. I did download Angry Birds. You guys can see they got me already. So this is cool. This is a 27-inch IMAX. So you guys can see it looks pretty damn good. I don't know what the exact resolution on the game is, um, but it looks pretty good. It's not like stretched or anything. And now I'm not going to do any work because I got Angry Birds on my iMac. Epic music. Oink. Right. Let's get a little piggy. See ya. He's toast. So one big thing with the app store is you guys can see I'm moving my hands like you guys can see me, but uh, we got the full screen going on. It just automatically stretches to the full screen, which is pretty nice. Uh, get over. Okay, get over. All right, one more. That's not that's not too bad. Got him. Toast. All right, so I'm gonna exit out of here. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna finish this video if I don't get out of here. I'll be here for a few minutes. Quit. Yes. So everything. Look, you guys see it runs smooth. We got reflow for music. It looks cool. Let's see what that is. All right. So this is kind of a Guitar Pro type thing. I don't know how it is compared to Guitar Pro. Ten bucks. It's pretty competitive compared to Guitar Pro price, though. For those of you guys that know. Uh, so we got Alfred Chopper Two, My Node. What's hot? We got lots of categories. Doesn't look like the top charts or anything have been. Oh, there we go. He's, so you click over it, it lights up. It is active categories. We've got business, developer tools, education, games, finance, entertainment, graphics, health, fitness, lifestyle, news, music, medical, photography, producti productivity, the reference, travel, sports, social networking, utilities, video, and weather. Let's go see what they got in graphics and design. Sketch me, slice, they got lots of stuff. So I'm sure I'm gonna be downloading lots of these apps. Health, fitness, that's cool. I mean, this is. Pretty exciting for the Apple, uh, a step forward in Apple. So I'm, I'm impressed so far. So I'm going to cut it short here. Got to get packed for CES. Excuse my voice. Just got over a sinus infection. So probably sounds like my voice is still gone. But I just want to give you guys a first look at this. Show you guys what it's about. Show you guys how smooth it ran and how Angry Birds looks. So I'll see you guys later in the day. Thanks for watching. And as always, feel free to subscribe.